flour here. This is bread flour. So we're mixing the rest of this flour. So if we can get it to uh, the stage here, put that in the front right there for now. If we can get it to the stage, I'll, I'll work it on the table a little. Add a little bit more flour. So again, we, so we want this dough to be um, tacky, but not sticky. So I'm gonna go up to speed four. There we go. And let it work just a little. So it's starting to pull away from the sides of the bowl, which is great. So we know it'll, it'll be able to, uh, I'll be able to take it out and put it on the table. So I'm gonna put a little bit of flour on the table here. That way when we're ready to throw and I'm also going to get our bowl scraper, have that ready. Okay. So I am ready to take this off, take off the bowl. So you can see it's a little, it's a little tacky. You can see it's a little sticky, I should say, right? So we're gonna scrape this really well. So it looks good. Okay, I'm gonna put a touch of flour just there, just so. There we go. Okay. Set the, sorry. Let me set that to the side. A little bit more flour here. More flour there. Alright. So. Now I'm going to work this a little. Get all that flour out. There we go. All right. So there we, we don't want to overwork our dough, but it's really, this is a nice dough. So you can see, look how smooth the top is. So we worked it. So rolling out, we'll also work the gluten a little bit, but it's now, it's a smooth elastic dough. We don't want to overwork it. This is tender. Very tender. So we are ready. So I have a pan. We know we set this here in the pan. Uh, spray the top of your dough. Always spray a little bit on top. And we're gonna have a piece of saran wrap. So we're gonna put it directly on top. Now, if I was going to double the size of this, then my marker, when I mark the circle, I go, way up on top, but since we're only going three-fourths of the way, we're gonna go a little bit shorter, maybe a, only an inch away from the dough itself. And make sure you put your initials. Okay, all right. So, I will put this in the proofer. Once it comes out, I will show you how to prepare the Ano di Gioli, Nocchioli, Nocchioli. Ano di nacioli, the hazelnut ring, and the colacci. The colacci is like the pizza that looks like uh, different toppings on top, but it's six different toppings. So I'll show you how to do those. Uh, if we're going to be making one for five, I'll show you how to prepare the uh, con rolls and also the uh, chocolate twists that we're going to be using. So, okay, I will see you in a few minutes and. Uh, Dough will be proof. Okay. See you in a few.